As you can see, this spool of chain is oxidized. It's got some tarnish on it. It's been sitting for a while. I was gonna use it, and then I was like, oh man, it's all gross looking. What you need to make your own silver tarnish remover solution is a bowl, a tablespoon of baking soda, some hot water, boiling water to stir in there, some aluminum foil, and some wooden chopsticks so I can fish out my pieces later, hopefully. No steel, only glass and plastic. No, no steel spoons, nothing like that. Okay, got my boiling water. I'll put in my baking soda. And about a liter. Ooh. Super sciencey. Okay. And now I'm supposed to add this. Put that to sink to the bottom, I guess. Oh, this is getting crazy. Okay, let's drop this first piece in that I showed you earlier. Oh, look at that. You can really see that, huh? Did you hear that? Okay, well here's a good test. This one's definitely oxidized. I've had this spring for quite some time. It's one I made for myself. So, I could use a little cleanup job and see how it works. Look at the clear difference between something that needed to be to be uh, cleaned. It hasn't gone in the solution yet, and this stuff has. It's really cool. It works. So I did that method to the half of this spool, and you can see the difference. It really did clean it up. like half of it's silver again and half of it's a little there's a touch of brown so yeah this was this was pretty painless I only left it in there for like a minute or so and it worked so I'm gonna put these ones in now and see what happens Here they are after their baking soda bath. Looks great. Perfect. Ready for some pendants.